Hey guys, Alex here, creator of the CropFit app, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today's workout is a full body HIIT workout, working with supersets, which is where we're partnering two exercises with each other. We're gonna be working for 30 seconds work, 10 seconds rest, and it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be hard, it's gonna get sweaty, so are you ready? Let's go. Starting in a warm up of three exercises for 45 seconds each. Starting in heel flicks, jogging on the spot and just lifting the heels up to your, up to your bum. Nice and soft landing on your toes and your ankles. This is our chance just to warm up through the body. You can aim to kick your heels to your fingers if you like. Relax your shoulders and start taking nice deep breaths. I'm very excited to start training with you today and start pushing our fitness forwards together. A chance to get stronger, fitter, leaner, healthier. Okay, starting in a step and toe tap. Stretching the hamstrings, alternate the legs, step and kick that leg up. Do what you can to reach your toes with your hands, depending on your flexibility in your hamstrings. You'll feel each rep starting to get looser and looser and you can kick up higher each time. Stretching down the back of the legs, the back of the body as we get warmer. Okay, come down to the ground. Let's activate our legs in bridge steps. Lay on your back, arms down, come up into bridge, come up to a single leg bridge, hold, engage, and then switch the legs without coming down, just holding up. This is the final exercise in your warm up. Core engaged, activate those hamstrings, glutes, lower back, go nice and slow. Keep breathing and feel your body get warm. Okay, that is warm up complete. We're gonna start in our first superset. So two exercises partnered with each other, 30 seconds work, 10 seconds rest, and our first exercise is a sprint on the spot and then a bunny hop on the floor. I'll show you, show you as you go. The first one is sprinting or jogging, doing your best to run as fast as you can. Get ready, in three, two, one, let's go. Time to sprint. Use your arms, pick up the knees, nice and soft landing on your toes and springy and powerful. If it's tough, you can just decrease the speed and intensity however you need to. Otherwise, work hard. Okay, rest there. 10 seconds, come down onto the ground into a bunny hop. So in our push-up position, bend your knees. We're gonna jump from side to side. Let's go. Side to side, bending the knees, core strong. Starting to work into the shoulders here as well, as the legs, of course, gonna burn into the thighs. Nice and wide in the feet, but depending on the floor you have, you want to make sure that you're not sliding and you're landing with control. Okay, so now you know the first superset. We're going to do those two exercises partnered with each other for four sets. That's one set complete. Let's go. The 10 seconds rest is quite intense. And we've got this non-stop to the end. But stay focused, be mentally here to give your best. 
And that is all that ever matters. Keep running. And rest there. Down we go into the bunny hops. My mat today keeps just sliding away. Get ready. Bunny hops. Let's go. Keep your feet together, land together, and jump up together. And now that we've done this, you can start thinking about maybe a bit more height. Push off the hands, jump a bit higher to the end, and rest. That's too, too complete. Two to go. It's fast pace, hard work. So, a bit of context for the rest of the workout. We've got three supersets to do overall. Let's go. And this is the first one. Get stronger at our running, our sprinting, working in that calf strength, ankle strength, as well as that cardio fitness. Get the heart rate up. And rest there, well done. Down we go to the floor. I'm gonna switch it round to this side. So like I said, see if you can start getting a bit more height. Let's go. Push off the hands, kick the heels up a bit more this time. Keep going. To the end, and rest. Well done. Who thought that beat was never gonna come? <laughs> thought we'd been stuck. Let's do it one more time, into the sprint. Deep breath, and we go. Powerful upper body and arms to drive the legs. Final time in the sprint to the end. And rest there. Now we've got one more set of the bunny hop before we move into superset number two. Get ready. Here we go. Last time. Kick up. Strong shoulders. We are working in full body strength and fitness. That's what's so great about this body weight, full body hip training, is we are working so many systems at once. Five seconds. Oh, well done. The fun continues. Superset number two is squat jumps and high knees. Starting in squat jumps. In two. Let's go. And we're squat jumping. If this is tough, go to your squats. That is fine. The legs are warm and ready to jump. 30 seconds. It's going to burn, but make sure the technique is good. Feet staying flat on the ground. Toes, heels, and then push up and jump. Chest up, flat back. Five seconds. Burn the legs. Stronger. And rest. Enjoy the rest because we're going into high knees. Similar to the sprint. You can go a bit slower, but get the knees up a bit higher. Here we go. So higher in the knees. Your goal is to get the knees to hip height or higher. Engage 
for the core. Stomach here, driving those knees up. And rest there, well done. So, two exercises, you know what we're doing. Squat jumps, find the version that's good for you. Here we go. Squat jumps, 30 seconds. Chest up, eyes up, feet flat on the ground, bum down. Good technique and whatever tempo is good for you. And rest there. Oh, my quads are tired already. That's a bad sign. Get ready. The high knees. We're in. Here we go. So, we're halfway through the workout. Focus. This is quick, fast, intense. Knees up, knees up. And rest. Well done. How your heart rate is through the roof. Get ready for squat jump. Again. Here we go. See what depth you can get with a good squat. Make sure. Your knees are tracking in the same line as your toes without caving inwards. Out, bum down, open up the hips. Five seconds. And a hand rest. Woo! Okay, high knees. Get ready. Are you keeping count? Is that three sets? Here we go. Get those knees up, nice and light. Just tap the floor and lift. Done. Awesome. Let's do it one more time. That's three complete. One more. Into the squat jump. Here we go. Final time. Burn out the legs. We are getting stronger in the lower body. More powerful. Building muscle. Getting more toned. You're here improving yourself. And that is awesome. Through the burn. Oh, rest. Ouch. Let's do that high knees. Final time. That's two out of three. Super sets done. Here we go. Final high knees. Give it everything. Knees up, stomach in, arms strong. Well done. 10 seconds rest before your full burpee. Full burpee, squat thrust, final one. Chest to floor, let's go. Hands down, jump back, lay down, roll up, jump up. If you can't or don't want to, half burpee here in and up or stand up. Final superset, it's the burpee. Put everything together from this good workout. Strong upper body, legs 
and cardio. Two. And rest there. Stay down on the mat for a squat thrust. Similar to that bunny hop you did at the beginning, but now we're just jumping in and out. Let's go. In. Out. Grip onto the floor. Shoulders stay above your hands. Use your core to drive those legs in. Ten. Bend the knees. Crunch the abs. Three. And rest there. So, those two exercises for three more rounds. Workout complete. I'm starting to overheat. The sweat's getting unreal. Burpees. Let's go. Hand up. Keep good technique. No injuries now. Always with control and good technique. Ten. And rest. Oh, keep finishing on the ground. What great timing. Get ready for the squat thrust. Round two out of four. Here we go. My mat is becoming a puddle. I hope yours is too. Stay focused. Keep driving. Don't let the energy get sapped now. Push to the end. Strong shoulders. I know they're burning. Three. And rest. We have two to go. And then we're at the end. Get ready for burp. Breathe it in. And let's go. That 10 seconds is tough recovery. We're working the fitness. Ten. Three. And rest. Oh, on the ground again. Ready to finish round three out of four. Deep breath, shake off the arms. Let's go. It's so close. Stay motivated. Stay. Focused. Keep going. This pain is temporary. The reward is after. Three. And rest. Oh, okay. It's just falling out of me. This is awesome. One more. Are you ready? Two. This is it. Finishing superset. No finisher. Nothing after this. Just one minute of work. Strong shoulders and arms. Core, legs, don't give in. Oh, rest. Okay, 30 seconds to the end of the workout. Do not drop those knees. Here we go. We're in. Do not give up. Final set. 10 seconds. Don't drop those knees. Three, two, 
one rest. Oh, wow. Oh my God. Now you can breathe. Rest, relax. Open up the chest, take deep breaths. You should be proud of yourself. That was an absolute killer. That small rest is what really gets you. Let's start in a couple of stretches as our heart rate comes down into a pigeon stretch each side. One knee comes up under your body. Stretch that back leg away. Nice deep breaths opening up the chest. When you feel ready to drop your forearms if you can. Okay, step back and switch. Stretch that back leg. Drop the hip onto the floor if you can, or towards the floor. Down to your forearms. And remember, fitness is not just how you recover, but um, how you perform, but how fast you can recover. Bringing that heart rate down to resting. It's also some manual work with taking deep breaths and telling the body it's time to now relax. Okay, from there, just open up into a groin stretch, feet together, knees out wide, elbows, forearms onto your knees, sit up tall and drop those knees down. Stay up nice and tall if you can, stomach in, allowing those knees to drop down to the side. Final stretch, cross the legs now. We don't spend enough time in this position. It's better than an office chair. I need to sit here more often. Great for the hips. And from here, place one hand down. You can mirror me and just reach over the top. Stretching the shoulders, the back, the lower back. Reaching the fingers high. And final, over to the other side. Reaching up, open the chest. Pushing your bum onto the floor, your hip bones onto the floor as you reach your fingers up high. Okay, well done. Workout complete. You should be so proud of yourself. That was intense hip supersets. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up, comment below, and come back and do this again and again and again because it is a good one and I will be. And if you want to train just like this, then download my Crocfit app and train with me there. And also, I'm fueled by a bulk always with aminos, protein shakes, and incredible functional foods and protein bars. So if you want some of that, then make sure you use the link in my description and my code CROCFIT for discount. Okay, thank you so much everyone. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.